To visitors, it's a quiet, historic harbor town nestled on the banks of the Northwest Olympic Peninsula. But take a closer look and see a city engaged in renewable energy. This is the future. You'll find it at the town's only mall, where this display shows what's in store for the future of green technology. I think it's my responsibility to spend some today to save a lot later and give all of my heirs a great place to live. Residents here are involved in a Bonneville Power Pilot project that uses an approach to energy management called demand response to store energy for later use. This pilot project involves thermal storage devices for both water heating and space heating. It's free. That was my biggest surprise. When the police chief got on board, we're remodeling the whole house. He quickly sized up the savings. The Steffi's heater gives us an ability to buy power at a much cheaper rate. We're moving to a new world where electricity is going to be more costly during certain periods of the day. The ceramic heater houses 40 bricks like this that heat to 1500 degrees. And then heat our home all day with just a squirrel cage fan running. Very nice dry heat. One homeowner saw an ad in the paper. We decided to just go for it and put our application in. The hot water heater is hooked up to a smart meter that enables a utility to heat the water to 180 degrees as needed. You can come down and look at when we've used energy. This allows users to adjust energy use around those peak times. We're looking for opportunities to store energy uh, with electric thermal devices or in-home heating devices, large industrial uh, processes, uh, even irrigation, the opportunity to shift irrigation loads. So we're looking at a wide variety of uh, technologies. Excess energy can occur in the Northwest when spring snowmelt overwhelms a hydropower system endangering fish. The surplus power needs a place to go to free up space on the grid for renewable resources such as wind. I mean, this is just one example of us taking a leadership position in renewable energy. This is just a fundamentally sea change for us where we need to start considering technologies such as these thermal devices to get us better prepared for the future. And the future is what the city of Port Angeles, Washington has in mind.